Good day, viewers. Welcome to Africa Concept TV, your number one reliable channel where you get updated and enlightened on what is happening around you. I appreciate you for the time spent while watching and viewing our channel. So if you are new on this channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button as well as the bell button to get updated whenever I drop any video. Viewers, today's headline reads, Balarebe Musa, in support of Erufai, says Igbos should produce next president come 2023. The news in details. Balarabe Musa, a former governor of Old Kaduna State, on Tuesday has supported comments by Nasser Erufai, governor of Kaduna State, that the southern part of Nigeria should be allowed to produce the country's next president. Musa, an elder statesman from the north, who spoke with Daily Post, said the next president of Nigeria should come from the southeast. Recall that Erufai had said that the North should hands off government in 2023. The Kaduna State Governor maintained that the southern part of the country should produce the country's next president in the interest of fairness. However, the elder statesman, while backing Erufai, stressed that in the interest of justice, peace and equity, the presidency should go to the southeast. According to Musa, Erufai said the presidency should go to the south right. I am also saying the presidency should go to the southeast for the sake of justice, peace, and equality. However, the People Democratic Party PDP National Publicity Secretary Kola Ologbodinya described Erufai's comments as political statements. Ologbodinya stated that at the right time, the opposition party would unveil its approach to the 2023 election. Erufai is operating within a political climate and is at liberty to make political statements as far as PDP is concerned. At the appropriate time, the party will decide its approach to use at the 2023 election, he told Daily Post. Thank you for listening to this news. Viewers, I will say that though prophecy is gradually coming to pass, but the fact still remain that the ego is not actually eyeing the seats of presidency. Yes, as far Biafran is concerned, I would say to you outrightly, the only Igbos that are eyeing presidential seats are those in the political seats, like the people of Eberibe, the governors of Eboin, Governor Omai, and Oji Uzokalo, who is already in jail, and some of them. But as far Biafran is concerned, what Biafran is after is freedom. Biafra don't need presidency to develop. What they need is freedom. And generally, I will say that we don't need presidency to develop. What we need is decentralization of the policy to make the center unattractive. Do this, you will have solved half of Nigerian problem. But failure to do this may lead to total breakdown of this country. I will tell you this, that the Igbos are 
only after their freedom, their freedom of actualization. And the earlier Nigerian starts eyeing that point of view, the better. Just as someone, a south, a south west, a, a, a south, a, a, a northern, for that matter, has given his own opinion, supporting the Igbos to come into power in come 2023. Not just that, but Erofi asking the North to hands up power. It means that the God of the Eagles and the God of Biafra has already started fighting. If you check it very well, you will see how everything is now is now working out. Not quite long. We had a date for 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 the discussion of biafran agenda was fused hope you're seeing that and now someone from the north is now supporting the Igbos to become president come 2023 hope you're seeing that so you can see that god on his own is single-handedly fashioning things out leaving it for us the Biafrans to decide which one to go with because I see it to be the time for the Biafran to achieve its its freedom and of which no man can place a stop on it. Erufai has not made any wrong statement. Neither is he trying to be political. He was just actually trying to be factual. Because the Northern has taken it for so long. Same goes to the Westerners. So for fairness and equality, it should go to the, to the Eastern part. But the truth still remains that the Eastern are only after Biafra actualization. And that is already close at heart. So I don't know what your own comments may be concerning this news. Whatever it is, don't forget to leave your comments behind. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated anytime we upload new videos. Thank you.